Get out of the city and into an adventure that moves the whole family. Prepare to be moved. The all new Nissan X Trail. A listener production. Good morning, I'm Amy Ross. From today, the much anticipated Head to Health service will begin offering free and accessible mental health services to adults in the Limestone Coast community. It follows a 12-month campaign, including a community petition, which member for Barker Tony Pazin says is much welcomed. Well, it's a fantastic achievement, one that the community campaigned alongside me for, and the fact that the facility or the service is available via Focus One at Sturt Street in Mount Gambier is awesome. Head to Health services will be available on Tuesdays and Thursdays, building up to five days a week by September. Accessing Centrelink and Medicare will be that much easier today. Services Australia is taking its office to you. Using a mobile van to travel across the Limestone Coast, meeting with local residents needing to make claims or registrations. Centre Manager Jane Sudler says a range of services are on offer. Centrelink, Medicare, Department of Veteran Affairs. We can also assist with if somebody has a child support inquiry, we can help and get them in contact with the best person to speak to and assist with that. A full list of the van's locations and timetable is available on the Services Australia website with staff welcoming walk-ins. Nearly $300,000 will be poured into local Limestone Coast programs that work towards building sustainable landscapes. It's all a part of the Limestone Coast Landscape Board's grassroots program. It's the fourth year the program has run and 14 projects will benefit from the cash. And students from Mount Gambia High have been busy in the kitchen. Staff from TAFE SA have been hosting a series of workshops helping the kids build hospo skills. After this, there is no turning back. You sip the red can, the story ends. You sip the black can, you enter dreamland. And I show you just how good the truth can taste. Max Taste Challenge. 80 goals, that's how many West Gambia slotted through the net at the weekend's win over Casterton Sanford. The visitors did put up a fight but couldn't get it done. The final score 80 to 40.